What's up, Chuchu Tuners? Welcome back to the Matrix channel. Please subscribe to the channel, like, share, comment, whatever you want. It helps us grow. Uh, today, we talk about some passing. And um, it's kind of a reverse and belly pass. So, first, I, I need to bring my opponent on the back. And then I sneak around, like, if I want to do a regular like, Toriando pass and bring my knee on the back. But everybody knows that. Everybody knows that. So when I try to get here, that's all I need. From here, I switch to the foot. Because I don't want him to be able to go here. Do a high pummel. Just bring this leg over and regard. I want to avoid it. And I know it's coming. Somebody knows what they're doing. So I'm here. That's, that's good already. From here, I switch to the foot. Now all I need to manage is cut my my knee through, go to the belly, post my hand, and go here. So my my right knee here beats his his left leg. My grip beats his high pummel and his capabilities of bringing this knee in or this leg over. Also, I flatten him. Like he wants to have a round spine. See now, see what he did. When I go away and he wants to keep fighting, he rounds his body, he closes everything. So I avoid that. So I'm here playing around. Yeah, I switch here. He, he tries to, of course, keep that high. I step, switch. Pretty much to this. And I'm here. I'm laying on his chest, almost face, but face would be too high. See now, everything here is free. I want to be here. So my knee is still connected to his hips. My hand here is very important. I'm not here. Now you feel my weight is off. I'm also not all the way here. Now my weight, weight is off this way. I'm really balancing nicely. You have to train this. You have to be comfortable here. It's this. It looks easy if you have the right timing. I, I use that all the time. You can also do it slow, sneaky, sneaky. From here, you have tons of options. The safest, like if I know somebody is very flexible, good scrambler, has good regarding capabilities, the first thing I would do is bring my head down to replace this, I bring my head down. Now I take the hand away and bring it to his opposite hips. Now I go down and have very good control. That's the, the safe way of doing it. That's the competition, the points competition way. So here, bring down. Sometimes I help with this hand. Boom. So, other options. Again, safe option is this. Other options. Especially if I have a gap here, like probably if you would fight, you would have your leg more involved. Now it's hard to get my leg down. But if I can, if I see there's a little, that's enough already. I take it out, bring it in, a cup, and I can right away go for really, really nice leg look entry here. I can I can go for uh, belly down or top side down cross ashi entry. Very very good. Probably my favorite from there. Yeah. Just sometimes I have to bring my leg out and in. Okay. <laughs> of course, you can just also sit to regular Ashigaram. Other options. Make sure you get an ankle first. Because from here it's too far away to get it. Ankle. If you turn, other side. Just need that grip. That happens a lot. They turn. No problem. Okay. So number one, safe option. Number two, cross ashi option. Number three, sometimes I, I don't even know when I'm doing this. I think maybe when they push too much with the hands. Yeah, then I I go heavy and yeah, exactly. And step over. If you're lucky, you're getting the triangle. If you don't get the triangle, you 
you get inside control on the other side. Here I feel really good. Here. 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 Or just break the side control. I hope I covered everything that I did from there. Uh, definitely try it. Oh, I forgot one very easy, very easy one. Sorry. Here, here. Yeah. Switch. If you feel better here, switch back to regular in your belly. Okay. So, just comment if you have questions about this. I'm still playing around with that. And yeah, let me know if you have questions or want to see more. Thanks for watching.